Hi, I'm Dr. Mark Halpern. I'm a chiropractor, and today we're going to be speaking about spinal arthritis. When discussing spinal arthritis of the neck, there are actually three different phases. If we look at the normal, the normal curve of the neck should be 42 degrees, and there should be no forward head posture. The ear should be right over the shoulder. It shouldn't look like that. In phase one, the neck has straightened and gone forward. The best way to understand this is, think of a banana. If you have a banana and you straighten it, what happens? It bursts or the peel bursts, the banana oozes out. And that's because when something is meant to be curved, there's more space inside of it than when you straighten it. Picture something being built uh, as a metal tube, and if you straighten that metal tube, there's actually less space inside that tube. It's just basic engineering. Our neck is no different. When our neck straightens over time, it squeezes the spinal cord, and there's less space for the brain to communicate with the body. And this affects every health uh, process of the body, every tissue of the body, how it heals, and the symptoms that we feel. And a phase one takes 10 years to develop. When we look at a phase two, as you can see here, there are bumps, Th that's spinal arthritis. When you see those bone spurs and that, that spinal arthritis, it's actually puncturing into the spinal cord and interfering with the way the body's working. So no matter what you do in a phase two, no matter whether you do Tai Chi or yoga, the diets we choose, the exercise, we, uh, exercise programs that we do, no matter what you choose to do, your body will continue to get more and more sick and break down over time. Because as long as that bone spur is putting pressure on the, on the spinal cord, your body cannot heal properly. If we look at phase three, the spinal cord is literally degenerating. We don't want anybody to get to a phase three. Using corrective procedures such as chiropractic biophysics, which is the most researched and proven uh, technique there is in terms of spinal correction, we can get people in a phase two and a phase one as close to normal as is possible for them. We don't accept phase three under that type of protocol because once the bones have fused together and the spinal cord is rotting, we can only do functional care. So if you're looking for some type of corrective care, Ask the chiropractor if they do chiropractic biophysics or another uh, corrective technique. And if they do, then they can help you go from a phase two to a phase one and back to normal. It's important to remember, we're not curing arthritis. What we're doing is creating more space in the spinal canal so that the brain can communicate with the body. So instead of treating disease, we're opening up a communication channel. I hope this segment's been very informative for you. And remember, strive to thrive.